Please subscribe and like so that you won't miss follow up on this stock and other market opportunities. I explain stock ideas that has great potential under 3 minutes and let's get right into today's topic. GoPro's stock popped around 34% last week from $4.6 to $6.18 after the action camera maker announced that high demand for its new Hero 9 Black camera had boosted its total number of paid subscribers past 500,000. CEO Nick Woodman also declared GoPro would exceed its previously stated target of 600,000 to 700,000 paid subscribers by year-end. That growth rate sounds impressive, but will it actually move the needle for GoPro's stock, which has tumbled more than 80% over the past five years, from its initial public offering price $24? How much revenue will 500,000-plus subscribers generate? GoPro initially launched the GoPro Plus subscription for cloud storage of photos for $4.99 per month or $49.99 per year in 2016. Users were limited to 62,500 photos or 35 hours of video, but it wasn't really a foothold in the subscription business. The standalone version, which lacks the attached subscription, costs $450. GoPro is marking down its cameras and offering a free annual subscription to boost its subscriber numbers. But looking ahead, GoPro expects its revenue to rise 68% to 91% year-over-year in the third quarter of 2020, and for its non-GOP gross margin to expand to 34.5% to 35.5%, thanks to robust sales of the Hero 9 Black and easy comparisons to the prior year quarter. The expansion of GoPro's digital channel will reduce its dependence on third-party retailers, potentially boost its gross margin, and support the expansion of its subscription-based services. That's a clever strategy, but its subscription platform could also erode GoPro's margins with higher cloud hosting expenses, free camera replacements, steep discounts, and fulfillment expenses for online orders. GoPro needs to find ways to generate recurring revenue from customers, and investors are still in doubt for its hardware-focused business model. Please like and subscribe to help this video reach more smart investors like you. No one can make better decision for you than yourself, and this is not an investment recommendation.